Welcome to Around the World Channel. Want to skip the next stock market crash? Don't fall for this dangerous investing myth, motley fool. The stock market has exploded higher over the past 11 months, rebounding sharply from the coronavirus bear market and producing amazing returns. Carmichael Restaurant demands answers from DoorDash after delivery person appears to steal money, KCRA Sacramento. Carmichael, Caliph. Stephen Tran never expected someone to steal his workers' hard-earned tips, especially someone who works for tips themselves. China's TIANWEN-1 sends back its first picture of Mars, CNN. CNN, China's TIANWEN-1 probe has sent back its first picture of Mars, according to the Chinese Space Agency. Their team killed himself. Now they want to save others struggling during the pandemic. NBC News. Chris Buckner was in his car, racing to try to get to his son, Dylan, before the 18-year-old killed himself. It was just after 3 p.m. on January 7, and friends had alerted Dylan's parents that he might. Putin is turning his main threat into a martyr will attack on Navalny, journalists and 5,700 detained Russians backfire, USA Today. The State Department says the United States is reviewing what actions they will take in response to the coup in Burma and the unrest in Russia following the sentencing of opposition leader Alexei Na. Christopher Plummer got a third act worth singing about, Associated Press. It's one of the great Hollywood ironies that Christopher Plummer didn't like the film that made him a legend. He was an actor's actor and had cut his teeth doing Shakespeare. BKFC 16 Knuckle Mania Highlights Paige Vanzant drops decision to Britain Hart in debut, MMA Mania. Former UFC star Paige Vanzant turned in her MMA gloves for a bare-knuckle boxing debut last night, Friday, February 5, 2021, at BKFC 16, Knuckle Mania Live on Fight. Supreme Court partly backs religious challenge to California virus restrictions, the New York Times. Judge Kim McLean Wardlaw, writing for the panel, said the church had not met its burden for obtaining an injunction. Fox News Media cancels, Lou Dobbs Tonight, NPR. Lou Dobbs on Lou Dobbs Tonight in 2017. After over a decade with Fox, his show was canceled Friday. Alex Brandon AP Lou Dobbs Tonight on Fox Business Network was canceled Friday. What's next for Morgan Wallen? The country music industry considers his future, and its own, Yahoo Entertainment. In his recent song Live in the Dream, a tellingly somber number that stands out amid his otherwise upbeat smash Dangerous, the double album, Morgan Wallen sings about how success is not all it's cracked. Please, like this video and subscribe to the channel if you want to stay tuned for upcoming news.